For the United States Marine Corps, amphibious ships are far more than mere vessels. They are the lifeblood of the Corps' mission, ethos and operational effectiveness. These ships embody the Marines' identity as an expeditionary force in readiness, always prepared to fight and win battles on foreign shores or provide aid in the face of disasters. Amphibious ships serve as both platforms for projection and symbols of the Corps' unwavering commitment to adaptability and rapid response. The San Antonio-class amphibious transport dock represents a major evolution in the United States Navy's amphibious warfare capabilities. Introduced in the early 21st century, the class was designed to replace aging vessels while meeting the demands of more expeditionary warfare, technological advancements and evolving geopolitical realities. The decision to build the San Antonio class was the result of a combination of operational needs, strategic priorities and lessons learned from previous ship classes. Embarking on a journey across the world's oceans, the San Antonio class ships are a testament to American naval might, with 11 vessels already in service and two more poised to join. In terms of size and displacement, the San Antonio class LPDs are impressive. Each ship spans approximately 684 feet in length with a beam of 105 feet, making them sizable platforms for a wide array of missions. They displace roughly 25,000 tons when fully loaded, which is indicative of their substantial carrying capacity and the robustness of their design. The sheer size of these vessels allows them to conduct complex operations, ranging from amphibious assaults to humanitarian aid. That's San Antonio in all its glory, carving through the ocean at a respectable 21 knots, its 105-foot beam leaving the wake as wide as a city street. This speed is facilitated by four turbocharged diesel engines, which drive two shafts. The range of these ships is equally impressive, capable of covering approximately 9,500 nautical miles at a cruising speed of 18 knots. This allows them to deploy and sustain operations across the globe without the constant need for resupply. <laughs> 